Hey, what's up guys? This is your boy Intel back here. This is the last video that I'm doing uh, for WrestleMania, I swear. Uh, this is the fifth one. I know there's plenty of matches out there. I did Sting Triple H, I did Brock Lesnar Roman Reigns, I did uh, the latter match, and I did Seth Rollins Randy Orton. So I know that there's other ones out there such as John Cena and Rusev, the Battle Royal, and uh, Paige, uh, the AJ Lee and Paige match, and the tag team title match. But this, we're going to talk about Bray Wyatt and uh, an Undertaker. I didn't want to do, like, you know, all the matches, just because I feel like that's fucking too much. I, I can't just, I'm going to have no voice by the end of it, right? Uh, I mean, like, every video is only five minutes long, but whatever. Uh, this is a match that I'm really interested in, because Undertaker at one time was undefeated at WrestleMania. He's got the most wins ever at WrestleMania with 21. Like, the next person behind him is, I think, Kane with eight. I think I read that on Reddit today. And then, like, the person behind him was fuck somebody with like seven or maybe it's nine and then somebody behind Kane with eight uh but he's got 21 wins right he's 21 and one uh Bray Wyatt says he's the new face of fear I think he absolutely killed it on this last Monday night uh I think he really he really fucking he made me if if I was if I wasn't already buying Wrestlemania I bought the pay-per-view because of what Bray Wyatt did on Raw him and Sting both fucking killed it on Raw this past week um I would have loved to see more from Undertaker but I think Bray Wyatt carried it enough that I'm I'm into it. And I don't think Bray Wyatt necessarily needs to win this match in order to come out strong. Because he's Bray Wyatt, right? I think he could, like, sacrifice himself, so to speak, to The Undertaker. Tell The Undertaker, take me out. And then, like, whatever. It doesn't matter because he's a fucking made-up character. He's not even, like, a realistic character. Like, Rusev is a guy. He likes Russia. And that's it. That's his character. Bray Wyatt is this fucking crazy psychotic man that fucking comes out with a lantern and he's he's got like these superpowers and he's the new face of fear and all this shit. He doesn't need to win ever. He doesn't need a title. He doesn't need to win because he's a fucking character and he all he needs is what Bray Wyatt has and he just needs to go out there kill promos, do it in the dark. He just fucking he's Bray fucking Wyatt. The Undertaker is the same way, right? Like the Undertaker. He won at WrestleMania every year, but he didn't need to because, god damn it, he's just a fucking Undertaker. He's a goddamn monster, a, a, a made-up character, right? Anyways, that's my rant about why Bray Wyatt doesn't need to win. Uh, I don't know, though. This one, like, of all the matches on WrestleMania, this is the one I'm most torn about, right? Because... I, I think this is an important reason why The Undertaker is on WrestleMania, right? Because a lot of people say The Undertaker lost. He doesn't need to come to another WrestleMania. But before to, before this WrestleMania, every time going into WrestleMania, I wasn't always excited for a fucking Undertaker match, right? Although, you know, sometimes I'd be like, I don't know. This might be the time Undertaker loses. Basically, I don't know. The one time he faced uh, Shawn Michaels, I was like that. Um... And then when he faced Triple H, I was like that. And Brock Lesnar and CM Punk especially, I was like that, right? Um, but before that, I was always like, Undertaker's going to win. No big deal. Don't need to watch the match. It's going to be a great match. That's cool. Undertaker's going to win. For the most part, when he faced like CM Punk, I was like, mm, Undertaker's going to win, most likely. But CM Punk might win, so I'll watch it. Yeah, I always watch it, obviously, but it's like... It's it's it used to be predictable in my own mind, right? In everybody's mind, it was always Undertaker is gonna win. Now Undertaker is lost, and you're thinking to yourself, I don't know, is Undertaker gonna fucking lose again? And this is the first time in a WrestleMania that I'm really about 50-50 on an Undertaker match. Like that's why it's important that Undertaker is there. It's not Undertaker lost, he needed to go away because he lost and now he's gotta retire because there's no use for him there. He's still the fucking Undertaker. He's still twenty one and one. He can still lose again, go twenty one and two, and then win next year and go twenty two and two. Um but I th I think that's important that this year's WrestleMania, I'm like, I really don't know if the Undertaker's gonna win. I really don't know. I have no fucking clue if the Undertaker's gonna win. Uh, my, my personal pick to win is The Undertaker just because I don't think Bray Wyatt needs to win, right? I think that Undertaker, I don't know. I don't think that they want to have Undertaker just start losing, you know, like 21 and one, 21 and two, then 22 and or 21 and three, then 21 and four. Before you know it, he's 21 and 21 and his under, and his fucking streak is ruined. But, um, yeah, so I think Undertaker is going to come out of this one, uh, with the, with the win 
Uh, I think Bray Wyatt's going to look incredibly strong against the Undertaker. I think he's going to put on. I think they're going to both put on a, a decent match. I don't think Undertaker needs to fucking go out there and die. For the love of God, I hope the Undertaker doesn't die. He's fucking God. He's going to be. He's going to be out of it again. Um, but yeah, I think it's going to be a good match. It's going to be fun to see, like you know, Bray Wyatt versus the Undertaker character. You know, the, the character wise. Um, but I, I do think the Undertaker's going to win. Let me know, guys, what you think's going to happen. Uh, between the Undertaker. Let me know what you think is going to happen at WrestleMania. Uh, this is the last video I'm doing, so uh, any other predictions for any other matches, just leave it in the comments section below. I'll be sure to reply to you with why I think you're wrong and why I think I'm right, unless you agree with me, because I'm always right, guys. I'm a fucking mark, brother. I'm going to just start saying that in all my videos. I'm a mark, brother. Um, I don't know why. I'm going to fucking... That's my new fucking motto. Don't steal it. Uh, this has been your boy Intel. I'm out. Bye.